Hey guys, what's up? It's the Diva in Distress here, and today I'm going to talk to you about New Jersey Transit. So if you live in New Jersey, you know for sure how bad New Jersey Transit sucks. It's the worst service created by man ever. And I have some shit to say about it. Here it goes. Here's reason number one. Reason number one is you never know what you're going to get with New Jersey Transit. You are on a roller coaster ride here. You're going up, you're going down, the lights are going to go off. A hey. oh, wow. lost power on New Jersey Transit. A mm. hey. munchkin's going to come out and attack you. You're going to You don't know. You might fly off the Mario Kart Rainbow Bridge. Never know what will happen on New Jersey Transit. It's ridiculous. Reason number two why I cannot stand New Jersey Transit is that you can never get anywhere on time. If you have an interview, forget it. You might as well go to, you take New Jersey Transit at night. Get a hotel, wake up, and then go to your interview. Because you won't get there. New Jersey Transit should provide its customers with Xanax. Be kind. New Jersey Transit should provide its customers with Xanax. Because you're going to be so anxious that you're going to be late. And, you know, you just come to get used to it. You will be late using the service. The only time New Jersey Transit isn't running late is usually when I'm running late. Which is all the time. So sometimes it works in my favor, but as a general rule, you know that that Northeast Corridor shit is going to be 15 minutes late. Oh, well, well, what do you know? We lost some power on New Jersey Transit again. Hmm. Now for number three. Number three is that no matter what place you park in, there's never any parking. Here is my parking ticket. Oh, see that? It says... Well, it says 8.27 a.m. That's what time I came here today. My train boarded at 8.41. It should not take mm, 13 minutes to park my car and to get a ticket. But for some reason, in Metro Park, it does. You need about an hour to find a parking spot for your car on a weekday. Which, pretty much, you might as well drive there. Reserve parking? Reserve for who? The Dalai Lama? Mm, no. Reserve for me. Oh well. Too bad, too sad. And then, you're running like a man woman. Your hair gets like all fucked up like this. And you get this little pink slip. You pay $5 for this pink slip. You mean to tell me, New Jersey Transit, that you can't start your own e-ticket system where I could just plug that into my iPad and get an e-ticket? Oh, mm-mm, mm-mm, you can't because you want that $5 surcharge. That $5 surcharge is going to, I don't know, the president of New Jersey Transit, who sucks because the service sucks. So, your service is run by your leader, so service sucks, leader sucks. Hmm. New Jersey Transit really sucks because the train scheduling sucks. There's a 1 a.m. train home and there's a 4 a.m. train home. I mean, granted, they're 117 and 423, but still, it doesn't matter. Those are the worst times ever. 1 a.m. is way too early. The party in the city, it hasn't even started at 1 a.m. Are you kidding me? I'm not leaving at 1 a.m. just like a catch the train. And the 4 a.m., by then, I am pretty drunk. So, it's a bad choice for me to take the 4 a.m., but, you know, here I am in that rock and that hard place again, always having to do the craziest thing. It really stinks because you'll be getting hit on by bombs. You know, you're that girl, like, when everybody's going to work, you're the one coming home. But what are you going to do? Leave at one? I do not think so. So, unless somebody else has a better option, you know, like their car service complimentary, thank you. I'm going to take that 4 a.m. train. And that sucks. So, you should make a 2 a.m., a 3 a.m. Those would be a lot more reasonable than 423 
or 121. So here's number five. Okay, so New Jersey Transit, it's supposed to be a public service. Therefore, you think that the wages would be cheap to use their public service. No, they're definitely not cheap. They're so expensive. They have more hikes than a stripper's skirt. It's ridiculous. Why? There's no incentive to use this service. It's horrible. It's always late. It's expensive. And so why should you even use it to begin with? It's absolutely ridiculous. Here's some final thoughts about why New Jersey Transit sucks. Well, the door in the older trains, they're about 10,000 pounds. You get slammed with the door. And when you have your stuff, you can't get out because it weighs way too much. And you're just, like, making a huge scene falling all over the place. And it's embarrassing. And the bathroom smells like, you know, 2,000 people had, like, a pee against the wall contest and made the best designs and it was never cleaned and um, that's about it. it if you have anything to add feel to hit me up on my page and have a good night love the deep in distress